Izzy and Roly too. Lofty and Wendy join the crew. Bob and the gang have so much fun. Working together, they get the job done. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Bilchard and Bird, Travis and Spud, playing together like good friends should. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. It's insulation, Mark. Wendy and I are going to lay it in Mrs Potts' loft. It saves energy by stopping heat escaping through the roof. <laughs> like a woolly hat for a house? Yes, Dizzy. I suppose it is. Right. Are we all ready? Yes, Wendy. I think that's everything. Can you fix it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Uh, yeah, I think so. See you later. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye. Hello, Mrs Percival. Here's the ladder you wanted to borrow from Farmer Pickles. Oh, thanks. I need it for the school play tonight. Anyway, I'd better get back to work. Do thank Farmer Pickles for the ladder. Oh, look at this. I bet I could be the greatest actor in the world. Ha-ha! <laughs> ha Long John Spud! <laughs> Fiercest pirate of the seven seas! What did you say your name was, stranger? I didn't. Hey! Face paints! A scarecrow could have a lot of fun with these. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, yes! I'm, I'm Spud the Dragon! Rawr! Mrs. Percival won't mind if I borrow these. I'll get them back in time for the school play. Rawr! This won't take long, Mrs. Potts. I'm afraid there's lots of old junk up there. <laughs> you never know when something might come in handy. Don't forget, only step on the roof joists, Bob. If you tread in between, your foot will go right through the ceiling. OK, Wendy. Wow! Look at all this stuff. There's carnival bunting and old curtains. And what's this? A tambourine! Oh, here's Muck. Now for some fun. Hello, Muck. I'm a magic dragon. Ma ma magic dragon? How do you know my name? I'm magic. Uh, I know everything. Wow. Would you like me to grant you a wish? Uh, yes, yes, please. Right then. Close your eyes. Wow. Now, um, what can I ask for? Um, maybe I could be twice as big so I could shift lots of soil. Uh, or um, I could have another set of headlights so I don't get scared in the dark. <laughs> oh, I know. I wish I had a great big pile of mud to muck about in. Hello, Mr. Magic Dragon. I've made my wish. <sighs> He's vanished. He was magic after all. But where's my wish? Maybe it's waiting for me back at the yard. Hi, everyone. Hello, Muck. Oh. Oh. <laughs> um, what have you got on your face, Muck? What? What? Is it... is it mud? No. You've got a cat face. Wow. I wonder if this has got anything to do with the magic dragon. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Oh, oh, this is great fun. Oh, honestly, Bob, you're noisier than Rolly. Oh, oh, oh! Look out, Bob! Oh, oh, oh! Oh dear! <laughs> Are you all right, Bob? Um, 
I'm fine, Mrs. Potts, but my leg seems to be stuck through your ceiling. Sorry. Can you fix it? Yes, we can. <sighs> Lofty, Bob's had a little accident. Oh, is he all right? He's fine, but could you pop back to the yard and fetch some plasterboard, white paint and a bag of plaster? Um, OK, well... Now, let's try and get your leg free. <gasps> OK, Bob, I'm going to push your foot up after three. One, two, three! Oh, 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 oh. oh thanks, Wendy. <laughs> That's OK, Bob. <laughs> Here comes Lofty. This should be fun. Oh, I'm a scary fire-breathing oh. dragon with googly eyes. Oh. <laughs> Spout the dragon strikes again. Oh, Bob, Wendy, a uh, 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 big scary dragon gave me a fright. Oh, Lofty, there aren't any dragons round here. Uh, there is. I saw one. It had, um, uh, googly eyes. Oh, now, come on. It's all right, Lofty. Calm down. Tell you what, I'll ride back to the yard with you to make sure that there are no dragons about. Oh, uh, um, OK, Wendy. Look, Lofty, there aren't any dragons now. Oh, um, no, there aren't, are there? Hi, everyone. Wendy, look, a magic dragon's painted on my face. Oh, I saw a dragon too. Hmm, sounds to me like someone's up to mischief. There you are, Mrs. Potts. Your loft's all insulated now. Oh, thanks, Bob. Thanks, Wendy. Sorry about all the mess we made. <clears throat> I mean, all the mess I made. <laughs> Bye, Mrs. Potts. <laughs> oh, 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 it's the scary dragon! Oh! No, it's, it's the magic dragon. It's not a dragon at all. I know that voice. Uh-oh. Come on, after him. <laughs> Just as I thought, Bud the Dragon. Oh, I'm sorry, Wendy. I, I was just having some fun with Mrs. Percival's costume. I was going to take it back in time for the school play. But look at it, Spud. It's ruined. I think we'd better go and tell Mrs. Percival what's happened. Oh, do we have to? Oh, dear. I don't know if I can repair this in time for tonight. I'm really sorry, Mrs. Percival. Just a minute. I've got an idea. Ta-da! One dragon costume. Oh, it's fantastic, Wendy. You've used Mrs. Potts' old junk. Well, she did say it might come in handy. It's Wendy the dragon now. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha